It's Thursday, it's past 4 p.m., and the day is officially over. So grab yourself a drink, kick back, because it's happy hour in New York City. U.S. stocks, they were little changed Thursday as investors pondered accelerated tapering by the Federal Reserve, a drop in jobless claims as well as corporate earnings. Now, the Dow Jones Industrial Average did erase most of the day's losses with the S&P 500 stepping into positive territory with healthcare performing the best, while the Nasdaq remained in the red. Decliners and advancers, they ran almost even over at the New York Stock Exchange this afternoon. And now we take a look to see how the markets closed out this volatile session. In the other markets, crude oil futures, they lost 61 cents to finish at an eight-month low of 91.66 a barrel. Gold futures rising $3.90 to settle in at 12.29.40 an ounce, and the dollar, that fluctuated against its counterparts. In economic data, applications for unemployment benefits, they fell by 15,000 to 330,000 last week, below estimates of 340,000, while a separate report showed the number of planned layoffs at U.S. firms fell 32% in December to a more than 13-year low. And in the corporate news, we had Macy's surging after the department store chain projected profit that surpassed estimates. And lastly, Alcoa shares dropping 1.6%. This after the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission on Thursday said it had charged the aluminum producing company with violating the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act, saying that its subsidiaries repeatedly paid bribes to government officials in Bahrain. So there it is. One more day left until Friday. So breathe, stretch, and shake. Well, shake it out and have that drink. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow morning. For ModernWallStreet.com, I'm James Flynn.